Hey everyone, it's nice to see you tonight. So I had a really good idea for a lesson, but I'm not sure if I have all the supplies to help me with teaching lesson. Let me look around and see if I have, oh, here it is, here it is. I thought we'd do, we didn't do mask night. So I thought we'd do mask night. Hang on, let me get prepared and ready here. Okay, all right. There we go. Do you have a mask that you have on? You can take a picture of you and your mask. You can even see my eyeballs in there. There you go. All right. So we're ready for mask night. Okay. So I thought I'd. What, what are you doing? I got my You're mask. You're late. You got your mask. I don't know if I wore it right. What, what, did you, what did you do to your mask? I was trying to be safe. You're trying to be safe. So my germs. Oh, you have. Oh, you thought that kind of mask? Oh. I was confused, so I wore both masks. You wore both masks? And I okay. didn't know. Yeah. Am well, I that's... doing it right? Sure, you can do it right. Because that's what masks are for. They're for, they're for protection, because you're, you're being protected. And they're for a disguise, you know, to have fun. Yeah, that'll work. It's interesting. My nose itches. I hope it's... Okay. My nose isn't runny, is it? You're making my nose itch by talking about your nose itching. No, we should be okay. <laughs> That's disgusting. Okay. That's your mask for sure now. Hi, everybody. Okay. Well, so, well, I'm going to take this off so that I can read because it's very hard for me to read. So, are you okay? I think so. You think so? Maybe I should take mine off, too. Do you want to take yours off, too? Yeah. Do you want some help? Uh, Hang on. You might want to loosen this. Okay. Thank you. Okay. And then, because uh, I'm not touching that. Uh, okay. Uh, hey. It's me. Yeah, it's my friend. You okay now? <laughs> yes, I can okay. read. Well, you know, I have I have some letters. You know how I like letters. You know how I like letters? Yes. Okay, you want to hold that letter? Hold it right there. No, 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 just one hand. Okay, hold that one. I'll hold this one. And this one. What do we spell? Mm and A is ma, then S and K is mask yay that's that's a little slow side but yes we've spelled mask all right so okay we you, were wearing a mask already we were okay hold up your letter m. m all right letter m do you know what letter m stands for make a glad heart like smile like smile yeah hey there's a bible verse in psalm 16 9 you want to read it yes it's right there therefore my heart is glad can you say it happier therefore my heart is glad there you go. And my glory rejoices. Uh -huh. My flesh also shall rest in hope. <laughs> Is right. that good? Yeah, that's that's good. Yeah, they're they're probably getting a kick out of that. So yeah, we definitely have to find our joy and happiness. I know this is crazy. You know, when we I, I don't want to touch it, but you know, when we talk about your mask, okay. Wait, I have one here. When we talk about oh, it's stuck. When we talk about having to use these, have you had to go to the store yet and somebody said you had to wear one of these or you've seen some people wearing them? Yeah, that doesn't always bring me a lot of joy. But you know what? I'm still going to find the joy in it. Even if I have to wear one of these things to go shopping, I'm just glad that we get to start getting back to a little bit of normal. Are oh, you going to put it back on? Okay. All right. So even when if you have to wear one of those or not, um, you know, we still need to find our joy. You know, this is our for our protection right now. All right. But, um, you know, we still can no matter what. We can just... Glory and that God's got it all in control and, and we're going to be okay. You okay? Yes. Okay. I all might right. take off my mask. You can take it. You didn't have to put it back on. I'm just showing them. Oh, okay. All right. I'm going to go to letter A. Letter A, are you ready for it? Ask for help. A is? Ask for help. That's what I just said. Oh, A, S, K. Ask, ask for, help. for help. Yeah, ask. Who do we ask? ask? Well, you know, if we need help for something, we definitely should ask the people that are around us, you know, like our grownups and stuff that help that are there for us. Yeah. But you know what? Because they're smart. Yes, they are. But sometimes, you know, what we need to just ask God for help. And so when we're having trouble, you know, many of you are going to school and you've and got some hard. stuff. Yeah. And there's and it's, and it's hard to just stay at home all the time and, and not come into school. And so, yeah, we definitely need to ask God. For Sometimes help I ask still... God to help me stay home in bed longer, but I <laughs> yeah, have to get up. I, I know, but you still got to get up. But, um, you know, when something goes hard or something is bothering us, you know, and, and we don't really know the words to say or how to ask or who to ask, you know, we can always go to God and ask him to help for everything. Okay. You want to put that one up? Yes. Okay. And I... is that, do we do a Bible verse? Oh with yeah, that there one? is a Bible verse. What is that one? First Peter five, seven says, casting all your care upon him, for he careth for you. Definitely. So that means, Cassie, we need to share our problems, yes. our things that trouble us 
Definitely. And and just our thoughts too. Yes. Because he talk cares to, him. to hear from yes. us. And how do we talk to God? Through prayers. Through prayer, yes, definitely. When but we pray you, to him and talk to him. You also just Oh yeah, talk just to him talking out. to him. Yes, definitely. Like in the so. car alone or in the back seat of the car. Yes. Just laying on your bed. My mine you know. was always um, mine's always at night, right before I go to bed. That's that's what I do. I that's my last time to talk to God and pray and just talk to him about the, my day and stuff. Mm -hmm, that's what I do. Okay, can we go on to S? Oh, I got that. You got it? Okay, S serve. Serve. Yeah, serve him. You to know, like, like help? Serve, like to help. Serve. Yeah, 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 yeah. To be a helper. Yeah, to be a helper. Um, mm -hmm. and everything we do, if we're doing it and we're then we're helping God. Okay. So if I and what are, what's the one thing that kids are supposed to do? Obey. Yes, obey who? Their parents and yes. God. Yes, the, the Bible verse says, obey your parents and the Lord for this is right. So anytime that we're obeying them and doing what we're supposed to, we're actually serving God. If we're helping mom carry in the groceries, we're helping serve. We're helping her, definitely. And then we're also helping God. When when we get to come back to church, we'll be able to do things there. And so just anywhere where we can be a help to somebody we can serve. So, Is there a Bible verse? So every night I take out the garbage, I'm helping God? You are. You're helping me and you're helping the Lord. And I'm helping myself staying out of trouble. Definitely so. What's Galatians 5.13 say? For brethren, ye have been called unto liberty. Only use... Not liberty for an occasion to the flesh, but love serve by love serve one another. Sir, yes, because we love. Don't be selfish. Who are we supposed to love most? God. Yes. <laughs> okay. I, I kept that one right. Yes, definitely so. Yeah. Yes, we do love God first, and and so yes, and so if we are loving Him, then we are definitely going to be serving and helping others. Okay. That's right. Yeah. Put that up. Oh, I know. Last one. Yes. Cake. It's a cake. All right. And you know what it's for? Uh, keep. No, no, no. I d no, 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 no. Yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah, okay, to good. Know something. Okay. So who are we supposed to know? Look, read our Bible verse, Psalm 37, 3. What's it say? Trust in the Lord and do good. Mm -hmm. So shalt thou dwell in the land mm -hmm. and verily thou shalt be fed. Yes. So we need to definitely trust in the Lord because you know what? No matter what all craziness is going on around us, we just have to keep our eyes on the Lord. Trust in him because he is going to take care of us. I like that verse because it says, Thou shalt dwell in the land and verily thou shalt be fed. God is going to take care of us. He's going to take care of everything. He's not going to forget us. No. There are verses in the Bible that talk about birds, um, about how he cares for the birds. Remember that verse? How he cares for the birds. And if he cares for the birds, then he will definitely care for us. And so he knows how many hairs are on your head. No, oh, that gets easy every year. There's well, you less. have a lot of hair on your face. Too. Oh, yeah. It's growing here. Yes. I had like a transplant and it went to here. No, it didn't. But yes. All. But if we just trust in him, then we're going to do um, we're gonna do well. I, knows, I think so. This is our last time together. Can I put Kate down? You can put Kate down. So as we get ready to end our mass night, I just want you to know how much I love you and I miss you. You want to say the same thing? Say I love you and I miss you. I love you. And I miss you. Yes. Also. We definitely do. Um, the kids at Sparky's, the kids at church, we just love you all so much. And um, for those of you that are watching, we just um, can't wait to see you again. It just be after the summertime. Yes. Hopefully everything will be back to normal by the time school starts again. And then Sparky's, wherever you finished off, um, we'll catch right back up. And then um, we still have some activities that we normally would do at this time of the year. Uh, Mrs. Creel's got some, some things up her sleeve, some plans up her sleeve. So... Not your sleep. Her oh, sleep. Mrs. Creel's sleep. Mrs. Creel. Yes. Next time I see her, I'm going to look up her sleeve. I don't think you should do that. Don't touch her? <laughs> I don't think you should do that. Maybe I won't touch her. Anyway, she's got some plans, and so we'll be able to still do some great fun things. And so until then, until we see you again, mwah, love you bunches. Be safe, be safe and obey God. Yep, wear your mask if you have to. But remember. This mask. Remember, be glad. Ask for his help when you need it. Okay, serve him and love others and definitely know that you need to trust in him. Love you bunches. Good we'll job. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye.